Good morning, good morning, good morning, families. Great to see you all this morning on this fantastic Friday, May 15th, 2020. Thank you guys for joining us. We're excited to kick off our fun Friday uh, morning meeting here together. I want to give some shout outs to those of you who are in the chat with us this morning. So let's shout out uh, good morning to Caprice and Miss Jefferson. Great to see you. Good morning, Solano and Jackson family. Great to see you guys in the chat. Um, good morning, Kitsia and Chloe. Good morning, Cornisha. Great to see you guys. Good morning, uh, Morgan. Great to see you this morning. Good morning, good morning. And from Ephraim Williams, let's shout out and say good morning, Mare. Good morning, Sean. And happy birthday, Sean. Uh, good morning, Khalil. Good morning, Cameron and Mom. Great to see you guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome to our morning meeting on this fantastic Friday. Super excited. Um, let's get things started the way we always do with our Pledge of Allegiance. Face the flag and follow with me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We're going to continue with our national anthem. Excellent, excellent. And now for our school song, Lift Every Voice and Sing. Excellent job, scholars. Thank you so much for joining us for our school songs this morning in our morning meeting, as always, from 7.45 to 8 a.m. Let's give some more shout-outs here to our scholars joining us and our staff joining us. Shout-out to Dr. Morehouse. Thank you for joining us this morning. Good morning to you, sir. Great to see you, uh, TGIF and D, Genesis and Mom. Good morning to Chabrene and Mary Kay. Good morning to Isaac and Lauren. Good morning to Cameron Daniels. Great to see you guys. Good morning, Mare. Good morning, Everybody who's joining us this morning, super excited to have you guys. Our recommended time for breakfast is 8 a.m. to 8.30. Classwork and teacher office hours from 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. Uh, yoga and fitness fun from 10 a.m. to 10.30. Lunch and recess from 12 to 1 is our recommended time. And then continuing with that, classwork and teacher office hours from 10.30 to 4.30. Shout out Miss Venetia, Brianna, Renee, checking in. Good to see you guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Keep leaving a message in the chat if you're here, guys. We want to see you. We want to celebrate you. Our morning meeting is a time to build our community. 
We also have our food service continuing today with grab-and-go breakfast and lunch available between 11 a.m. and 12.30 p.m. with drive through service at William Lee College Prep, 3300 Stockton Boulevard for any Fortune School scholar. Make sure to stop by and pick up your grab-and-go breakfast today. Shout out Director DeBose. Good to see you. All right, so it is Fun Friday, and so uh, before we continue with the rest of our announcements, I do need your help. So I'm going to pop a little poll up here. I'm going to try this again. Um, we tried this once before, and it did not work as great as I would have liked, but that's all right. We're going to try again. Um, we have a little poll that we're going to pop up on your screen for a Go Noodle choice. Um, for which Fun Friday Go Noodle activity should we do today? Now, these are dances. These are interactive dances that we can do together. So we're going we're gonna to choose one. Your choices are Jump, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, or Bye Bye Bye. All right, so those are our three choices. I've already got votes coming in, so I'm going to leave that up for you guys to choose and to vote while we continue with our um, with our ceremony, uh, not our ceremony, our morning meeting. Um, so we'll come back to the, the total votes at the end here and see which one has won, and that's the Fun Friday activity we will do today. So I'm going to continue on with our production, but keep voting. Uh, make sure to check it out. All right, let's see here. Good morning to Mr. V. Buenos dias. Oh, look at that. I got it. All right, let me try that again. Buenos dias, familia de Ephraim Williams. Feliz Viernes. Love it. Love it. Great to see you, Mr. V. All right. We have some birthdays to celebrate and shout out today. Let's shout them out. Uh, today's birthday is Sean. Happy birthday, Sean. Turning 12 today. Big day. Happy birthday, Sean. We hope you have a great day, great weekend. Really celebrate it with your family. Go big um, and enjoy your day. All right? Make sure to shout them out in the chat. Um, give them a little birthday love with some birthday messages. Good morning, Janelle. All right. Great to see you. Janelle Johnson's grandmother. Oh, great to hear from you. Thank you for watching. We love it. We love it. We've also got some top 10 scholars to recognize today. It is Friday after all, so every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, we recognize our top 10 scholars in Reading Eggs and in Moby Max. So, for Reading Eggs, at number one, we've got King. Congratulations, King. Well done this week. Finishing up the week strong at number one for Reading Eggs. And number two, congratulations, Israel. And number three, well done, Sensore. At number four, great job, Rhythm. At number five, keep up the great work, Ricky. At number six, well done, Quentin. At number seven, keep up the great job, Chloe. At number eight, well done, Yuretsi. At number nine, good job, good job, Renee. At number 10, keep up the great work, Arlie. Great job to our top 10 scholars for reading eggs. And now for our top 10 scholars in Moby Max. Congratulations at number one is Marcel. Great work, Marcel. At number two is Joshua. Well done, Joshua. At number three is Lauren. Keep it up, Lauren. Great job. At number four is Ethan. Well done, Ethan. At number five is Rajon. At number six is Malachi. Good job, Rajon and Malachi. At number seven is Amaya. Keep up the great work, Amaya. At number eight is Elaine. Oh, thank you for that shout out, Miss Castillo. Great job. Yes, good job to our scholars. At number nine is Daniela. And at number 10 is Cincere. Great job to all of our William Lee Top 10 Moby Max scholars. Keep working hard. Remember, scholars, every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, we will shout out our Top 10 scholars completing their lessons every week. So make sure you're on those lessons, working hard, putting in that hard work, and you too will have a chance to be recognized. Let's also recognize our Ephraim Williams College Prep Top 10 Scholars. At number one, finishing up the week strong, is Elise. Great job. At number two is Cameron. At number three is Alejandra. Great job, Cameron and Alejandra. Great job. At number four is Cameron. Another Cameron, Cameron M. <laughs> Great job. Our Camerons are working hard. Filling two of the top ten spots. I love it. At number five is Savannah. Great job, Savannah. At number six is Alexandria. Keep up the great work. At number seven is Valeria. Well done, Valeria. At number eight is Brandon. Keep up the great work, Brandon. At number nine is Jacob. Well done, Jacob. And at number 10 is Anissa. Well done, Anissa. Keep up the excellent work. Great job, great job to all of our scholars. 
Well, May 15th has meaning for people all over the country. Today is actually National Chocolate Chip Day um, and International Day of Families. So make sure, scholars, to celebrate with your families. Uh, make sure to enjoy your, your weekend together. Make sure to take some time just to say I love you, to say thank you, um, and to celebrate just you know being a family. So give them an extra hug um, and make sure to let them know how much you care about them. So happy International Day of Families. And then when you're done with that, celebrate with a chocolate chip or two because it is, it is National Chocolate Chip Day. All right. So those are our holidays for today. Make sure to save the date for our promotional ceremonies coming up. Our promotion ceremony for kindergarten is Wednesday, June 10th at 12 p.m. here on Facebook Live. And that, that will be for all of our William Lee College Prep kindergarten scholars being promoted to first grade. We're super excited for them. So make sure to come out and join us in celebrating. We're going to have some special video guests. We're going to have a special celebration uh, video from our Kinder Scholars that we're working on organizing as we speak. So we've got, we're going to be pulling out all the stops to celebrate. So make sure to join us for that. It's going to be once-in-a-lifetime uh, virtual ceremony. I love it. Oh, yes, Miss Alvarez. Uh, I love it. Four sixth graders. Let's go. Love it, Sean. Good job. Yep. Let's keep those sixth graders working hard on that top ten. Make sure to also save the date for our promotional ceremony for fifth grade, uh, Thursday, June 11th at 9 a.m. on Facebook Live. That'll be our fifth grade promotion ceremony. So that'll be with all of our Fortune schools. So that's with Hardy Brown, that's with Fortune, that's with William Lee, Alan Rowe, and Hazel Mahone all coming together for the first time ever for our first ever combined fifth grade promotion ceremony. We're super excited. And then our 8th grade promotion ceremony um, will be on June 12th at 9 a.m. So that's you know going to round out that week for us um, and help us to celebrate all of our 8th graders from Hardy Brown, Alan Rowe, and Ephraim Williams. As we prepare for those promotion ceremonies, make sure to stop by today um, and next week to pick up your materials. So we've got second trimester report cards and awards available for all of our scholars to pick up. And then we have caps and gowns available for our kindergarten, 5th grade, and 8th grade scholars to come pick up for free, no cost. These are for you to keep, for you to celebrate, uh, but we do need you to come pick them up and then that way you can have them for the ceremony. Um, we're gonna have you take a picture and send it to us so that we can put it on the certificate for the ceremony. Um, so please make sure to stop by. We've staggered different times. Yesterday we went from nine to one um, for kindergarten through seventh grade. Today we're 12 o'clock to four o'clock. So if you're available from 12 to four, make sure to come on out, stop on by. Uh, kindergarten through seventh grade today can pick up. Next week, kindergarten through eighth grade can pick up um, from 12 to four on the 19th. Uh, Miss Venetia says, come say hi, because she and our other team members are there, um, you know, with masks and gloves and ready to greet you and uh, for drive through service. So you don't need to get out. You'll be able to just pull on up, say hi. We'll be able to give you your cap and gown or your, your second trimester rewards and report cards. And then next Wednesday, also from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. for kindergarten through eighth grade. So make sure to come on out, come pick up those things that, that we can have to help celebrate. Happy Friday, Miss Garrett. Great to see you. We've also got our 8th grade college signing day coming up next week on May 20th uh, from 3.30 to 5 p.m. Um, and then on May 27th from 3.30 to 5 p.m. It'll be online via Zoom with this meeting ID and this password. Um, and then things you'll need for the day, you'll, uh, need a, you'll, you'll need a scholar and you'll need a parent or guardian to attend as well. Um, uh, the video call to help assist with completing the application. You'll need your social security number of the scholar and then the most, rec most recent eighth grade report card. Um, so make sure to come by and pick up that second trimester report card um, uh, for that and so that we can be ready for that college signing day. I can't wait to see you guys there. All right, it is uh, our Refer a Friend campaign is still going strong. Um, we just had an enrollment meeting last night. Uh, I want to say thank you. I had several, 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 several people tell me that they heard about our schools because of one of our existing families who already goes to our schools. Because I always like to ask, how did you hear about us? And then so I had four different families last night tell me that, oh, I know two scholars who are already going there. That, that family said we should check it out. And so it was really encouraging to hear. So thank you guys for getting the word out. Keep it up. Ms. Zamora and Ms. Venetia are going to continue calling um, to reach 100% of our families. Um, and so if you have a family that you think you can refer to us, let us know. Help us out. Um, we're really trying to make sure we have every seat filled for next school year um, to have a fantastic school year together. So um, be on the lookout for that call. Also, <clears throat> you can just go to our website, fortuneschool.us forward slash RAF. Um, complete a short survey there to let us know who we can contact um, to join our schools. 
and then don't forget to visit our Facebook page and give us a uh, rating. Um, you know, make sure to recommend us by clicking on that rating. You can recommend or not recommend. I hope you recommend us um, to increase our rating. We're trying to go from 4.8 to 4.9. So, um, and we're trying to get more than just 19 people to recommend us. Let's really try to boost those numbers. All right, let's check back in with our fun Friday activity. We put out a vote. Let me pull it up here. All right, I'm going to show the results in the video here to see which one won. Okay, so overwhelmingly, we can see Jump got four votes, uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air got 11 votes, and Bye 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 got two votes. So Fresh Prince of Bel Air is our winner. Congratulations. And so I'm going to pull that up now so we can get that ready. Let me see here. Let me see, I'm pulling it up, and should be coming up on the screen right now. All right, there we go. It's preloaded. Let me make sure the sound is on so you can hear it. And let's get ready to follow this dance and song in three, two, one. NTV Noodle Television. Make sure to visit Go Noodle as well. Oh, it froze, of course. There we go. Get into it. Let's get moving this morning. Now this is a story all Look about how my on. life got flipped, turned upside down. And I like to take a minute just to sit right here and tell you how I became a prince of a town called Bel Air. There you go. There you go. I see you guys. Keep moving. Yeah. Show those moves. Let's dance this morning. Fun Friday. Let's get it going. You are on it. In West Philadelphia, born and raised That's On the playground is where I spent most of my days Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool And shooting some b-ball outside of the school When a couple of guys who were up to no good Started making trouble in my neighborhood I got in one little fight and my mom got scared She said, you're moving with your auntie and uncle in Bel Air suitcase and sent me on my way she gave me a kiss and then she gave me my ticket i put my walkman on and said i might as well kick it first class yo this is bad drinking orange juice out of a champagne glass is this what the people of bel air are living like hmm this might be all right i whistled for a cab but when it came near the license plate said fresh and hit a dice in the mirror if anything i could say that this cab was real but i thought man forget it your home's the bel air I pulled up to the house about seven or eight and I Keep yelled, going, Scully, you got your home, spell you later. <laughs> Look to my kingdom, great I was job, finally there. Job. And I sit on the throne as the Prince of Bel Air. Well done, well done. Thank you, scholars, for joining in with that fun activity. Thank you for indulging my poor dancing moves. Um, it was a great time. We'll have another fun Friday activity next week. Thank you guys for joining us. Um, have a great and fantastic weekend. Make sure to complete your classwork for the week today. Uh, make sure to jump into those office hours for any last-minute help that you may need. And we'll see you on Monday.